Welcome back, YouTube. I, it's rainy as all outdoors. It's supposed to be rainy all weekend. I'm uh, taking another shot, uh, doing some catfishing down at the Broadway Street Pier. Been about a year since I've been since I've been there, and um, been itching for um, some catfish on the other end of my line as well. I'm doing it despite the rain. So uh, that's what I'm doing. So stick with me in this wet and cool day. I just went and got me um, half pound of shrimp from the uh, market down here at uh, Broadway. And uh, this is what I'm going to be using for bait. I will be trying to fish for some live, some live bait so I can cut it up. So we'll see. Well, I'm finally here. You get to get this bait in the water. The tide is not uh, supposed to be in until around midnight, but I wanted to take my chances anyway. So here's the shrimp, and I'm going to be using um, I'm going to use the whole piece. As a matter of fact, I'm going to uh, peel it, some of the skin off anyway. I'm going to be using uh, floating some and some on the bottom. And taking the uh, peeling the, the skin off is to prevent um, not getting a good hook hook set if something decides to uh, hit my bait. So the water here is uh, pretty deep. 25 feet, I believe. And this kind of fishing, um, so my bait doesn't, my rod doesn't get pulled in the water. I set the drag really light so that it just takes it. And then I can just pick it up at my leisure and tighten the drag and bring it in. Uh, With, uh, with fishing here at the uh, Broadway, um, I wouldn't eat anything very big out of here, but eater size fish between five, six pounds, seven pounds is uh, in my opinion, safe to eat. These fish don't set up shop here. Uh, they, they go in and out. So the idea that uh, the fish are um, eating on stuff that we wouldn't eat um, is not necessarily true in its entirety. Um, and with catfish, um, it's good to clean them or soak them after you um, clean them to uh, pull out any um, impurities. And it makes the fish taste better. So, uh, I'm gonna get my other rods in the water and we'll see what we can do. Fishing down here does have a bit of its challenges. Um, boaters don't have good etiquette. Some do, but a lot don't. All the water in the world, and they are uh, coming through the area that you have your lines on.
Yes, indeed. The lovely head shakes. Sir. Nice channel cat. As wet as everything is today. It's got him right on the lip. on it get this back out and then uh decide what i'm gonna do with home homeboy here uh, i'm gonna keep him one of my subscribers. I uh, said so they wanted a catfish. Uh, so. Ouch. This is why I'm keeping him. He's a good size to, uh, to eat. So. He's going in the water. The stringer keeps him lively until uh, it's time to get out of here. Nice channel, cat. Nice channel, cat. One down, let's get a couple more. A 
I've been seeing a bit of a surface activity. Uh, small fish moving frantically across the, uh, the surface of the water. So I don't know what that is. Um, maybe it's rockfish. I, I don't know. Uh, but I'm going to toss out a uh, artificial lure that rattles to see if uh, This here is a uh, good lure that has been very good to me for our, our rockfish. Uh, this is a, a rattle trap. It rattles. So uh, this is what I'm going to be using on the, uh, the smaller rod. The temperature here is uh, actually pretty mild out. Uh, it's in the 50s, but it feels uh, it's, it's a little bit humid. And it's good to feel that with as wet as it is out. The rain has been pretty decent too, not raining much. I was able to get this one fish. But want some more. Got a hit. I got a hit.
I got a hit. Wow. It's a catfish. This catfish crushed this artificial lure. First catfish on an artificial lure. I tell you that. Oh, this dude got me tangled. There we go. Okay, got my lure out. Uh. This one, uh, seven and a half, eight pounds. Nice one. First catfish ever caught on um, that I've ever caught on the lure. I mean, you saw how how far he had it in his mouth. He crushed it. My boy crushed it. So I, I am gonna I'm gonna put him on a stringer. But if nobody wants it, I'll release it when I leave. Hefty catfish here. Ugh. Ugh. Look how big old boy is. Needless to say, this has not been dull. Exactly what I was looking for. Exactly what I, exactly what I was hoping for out here. 
think Broadway missed me like this as much as I missed it. I'm not even sure how long I'm gonna stay out here. But I'm loving the action. Got another catfish. Got him on the um the bar on the uh, barber. Hope he's still on here. Oh yeah. Man, this dude fighting hard. Tie yourself out. You see how arched this cat this rod is. Damn. I think he got me tangled up with my other rod. Oh God. I... Ladies and gents, I I don't know what's going on here. I, I got one on this rod here. Ah, something's going on with this rod here. 
It's a, it's, it's a fish. No, it's not. Got me stuck. Oh no, here we go. All right, so I gotta grab. These are uh, these are, yeah, these are catfish. Yeah. These are catfish. Nice. That's probably more than you can eat tonight, right? Absolutely. I but I was catching them for and giving them away, but yeah, they're more than enough. <laughs> right. Well. More than enough. You know, one of the cool things I like about fishing down here at the pier is that the uh, passers by get in on the action with their excitement. It's kind of fun. Okay. That there was on the uh, was on the barber, shrimp on the barber. Another nice size catfish, six and a half, seven and a half range. Nice size catfish. Nice size catfish. Uh, let's get him unhinged, unhooked. While I'm getting out of here, the fishing was great. It's going to two subscribers. One uh, is getting one, uh, Miss Holland, and uh, Danny Main from um, Finish Line Services. He wants three, so he's getting three. Um, the fishing was great, and I couldn't have asked for anything better.
perfect evening. Let me show you what, what, what I got before I head up out of here. Not out here long. Once again, folks, thanks for, for uh, supporting my channel. Get me out there. Put, put the word out. Tell them to uh, check my website out. I mean, my uh, page out. Channel out. You know what I mean. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. Until next time, keep it fishing. Very right, beautiful scenery.